Okay, gonna show you the inside of the Phantom 2 Vision transmitter. I'm gonna get ready to do the replace the transmitter antenna with a TP Link 2.4 gigahertz 10 dBi, actually 8 dBi uh, antenna. So what you'll want to do is remove the four screws one there, one there, one here, and one right there. Uh, also, uh, take the batteries out. Okay. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to carefully uh, lift the lid uh, up and actually tilt it a little bit because you'll see right here, uh, this lip fits underneath this shroud right here. Uh, and then it splits in half. So what you want to do is just pry it up and then pull it down and back and up. So kind of like that motion there. But pry it up from the back side a little bit. And then pull back on it. And you'll see that it will, it will separate. And then just be careful not to uh, pinch the uh, power leads your uh, positive negative okay so this is the inside and uh, here is the 5.8 gigahertz antenna and the UFL mini PCI connector you can see that it's silicone down to the board this one doesn't look too bad some of them that I've seen so what we'll want to do is we'll want to cut that away um, a little bit at a time to get at that connector and to get that off the board. And uh, be really careful when you're taking that connector off. Um, go slow because you could uh, end up pulling the uh, socket off the PC board itself uh, and then you're out of business. Uh, also, uh, here is the line for the antenna. It goes into this harness. Uh, it looks like it goes underneath, so you're going to have to fish that out, but basically this just pops off right here, and this just pulls towards you. Okay, I'm not going to pull that off right now, but um, this will be the first uh, of uh, two or three videos that will go through uh, using that um, TP-Link antenna. I'm going to use um, the same uh, connectors that I used for my repeater upgrade, uh, which you'll see right here. Used uh, two of those to uh, upgrade the uh, repeater. And I used uh, two 5 dBi uh, TP-Link whip antennas. Uh, so far, good results with that. Pretty happy with it. So just so you can see this connector again, I'll try to put some more light on it. I don't think, can't really tell if that helps any. But that's how it connects right there. And of course, uh, when you're putting it back together, just be careful not to pinch uh, these leads and any of these screw holes. Uh, make sure they're not being pinched uh, into any of the other controllers here as well. All right, that'll do it.